Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we are we are watching episodes two and no episodes three and four of Royal Victor. The last two episodes were very good, and I am excited to see where this story. Sorry, this like thing keeps sliding down. It's really annoying. Okay, right. Let's uh, let's get into these episodes then. I don't really have a lot to say about yeah, in the last two episodes. We just we found out at the end of last episode that Victor had been offered a job at the coffee shop that Benji worked at, and it looks like Benji is a love interest in this show. So hopefully we're gonna get some like we're gonna get some development there with Victor and Benji in these episodes. So let's just get straight into it then. If you like what you see today, then make sure you subscribe, turn the notification bell on like the video and then you can also follow me on Instagram if you fancy that it's cards.gilling uh, and I, I post all sorts on there so if you want to um, want to support me over there or just follow the account then go ahead well Simon I don't know what's going on because I thought I might be like you but lately I've been hanging out with Mia and is this his bisexual awakening <laughs> There we go. I heard somewhere that he might be bisexual. I just don't know what she sees in that kid. He's hot. He's kind. He's smart. He's good at sports. Great skin. His eyes twinkle. He smells good. And I bet he's nice to animals. I'm nice to animals. What kind of psychopath isn't nice to animals? <laughs> well, It'll regardless. We can get married and have a slew of gorgeous bilingual babies. Well, maybe we should double. Maybe we they go together. Will. They go together. Maybe they won't. Really? Yeah. Why not? But I have yeah. done some research on this show because I wanted to spoil it for myself. But only like little bits. <laughs> um, I know Victor and Benji do end up together. Like, am I spoiling it for you as well? Oh, we're at the coffee shop. Hey, good work today. Caught on fast. Thanks. I'm really interested to see where this is going to go. I know that Victor and Benji um, get together. I don't know if it's this season, but I know they do at some point in the show. So I'm interested to see what's gonna, how it's going to play out because Victor, at the moment, is looking at dating Mia. So I wonder how it's going to work out with Benji. Is he going to like have like... Is he going to be like stuck between Benji and Mia and he's going to have to pick one? Is it going to be one of those uh, storylines? I don't know. I'm interested to see where it's going to go. Or he could end up with Benji in like like later seasons. Okay, or let's see. Victor could end up with Benji in see, a later what? season. <laughs> you dance, come on. I don't know. All let's I remember is it, it, it involves a lot of... And then cheer from my band. Loudly. I'm a very insecure... You're in a band. Yeah. Ooh, Lead singer. Nice. You and Mia can come hang backstage after the show. If you want to. See, Simon, I want tomorrow night to be about me and Mia. But I can't do that if Benji's there with his tight t-shirts and his dumb smile. Um, we're doing something else tomorrow. Sorry. Oh, no. Uh, go to the battle of the bands. Let's go cheer Benji on. You brought me to an art show. Yeah, I saw this ad for an art of the future exhibit and- No, no offense people that like you're an artist of things the like this, so. but I couldn't think of anything more boring. Like, no thanks. I'm not going to an art expedition on a date. I mean, it's not about me though, is it? DJ F-bomb. Is it, um, Felix? Yeah. This one goes out to a very special lady. It's not Lake, is it? You're not... Uh, Lake's... Not into you, Felix. Sorry, but she's not... This would only happen to Felix. This is sad. Technical difficulties. <laughs> Who is that? I'm not sure, but the bomb is bombing. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah. Like, there's a job blew him everybody. You know, technology these days. Can't blame him. Well, uh, actually I can't compare it because this is the only first date I've ever been on. Come on. Guys must ask you out all the time. No, not like this. Are they gonna kiss? What am I doing? Yay! <laughs> well, Simon, I didn't it's real. I didn't it's not the first time. I would this. feel it, but it's in my Oh, look, way. he's playing the guitar. Oh, my still was holding rip jeans, skin was showing hot. I've seen that in so many films. So call me maybe. Oh, okay, well. I guess I like a male as well as a female. And that's okay. Fly over the Super Bowl. Or like. The woman was too stunned to speak. Oh. Getting hit. Okay. By a huge wave. Uh, hey, you guys. Okay, well, I'm not quite happy. I'm too happy yeah, about that. Yeah. Not happy about that. No. It's going to be a bit more complicated. Well, I mean, it is anyway because he's got things going with Mia, but. Okay. Right. So I like that Benji is starting to have a bit of a bisexual awakening. That's great. But this is getting a little bit messy. So he's he's with me, yeah? And he also likes Benji, which is fine. But now Benji's, you know, got... Well, is he, he's not with me, though, is he? He likes me and Benji. Just things are moving, obviously, a lot quicker with me. Yeah? That not only is he having a dilemma between two people, he likes two people, he's also... Um, like, you know, also Benji's got a boyfriend, which means that... I mean, I, I reckon that Benji's boyfriend will just break up with him or something later this season. Because like I said, I know what happens in this show. I know that Victor and Benji end up, end up together. But... Why is everything got to be complicated? Like, why can't we just, like, I mean... You know, even if Victor ends up with Mia in, like, you know, in... And then, I don't know what's going to happen, to be honest. I think we should just stop making assumptions and watch it and find out. So, it looks like things are going to start to get complicated. I'm ready for this. Let's go. Episode four. Truth hurts. It does. It really does. I'm sorry, Victor. But the truth does hurt. I'd give you a hug if you weren't a fictional character. And if I knew you. <laughs> Dear Victor, Benji has a boyfriend? That sucks. Before it does I was suck. Out, I was... It means he's off the table, so I can focus on Mia. I think you'll find that more difficult. And everything else is starting to log more into. More difficult than you think. I found my creek with... Honey, even though the sign says Victor is number one, I'm just talking about the basketball game. I love all my kids exactly the same. Uh, but if you had to rank us, I'd be on top, right? Definitely. She needs your guidance the most, because she's nasty. Oh, she knows okay. It. Amen. Ruin the moment. Hey, I don't care if you are jealous about Victor's big game. You may not speak to me that way. Yeah, respect your elders. You're wrong. Come on. Come on. Naughty, naughty. <laughs> Brought you a last slice of sausage. Oh, she likes sausage. So does Victor. So do I. I didn't say that. Victor, mom had an affair. What? No, she didn't. After I finished setting up her Facebook page, some guy named Roger R started messaging her all this creepy romantic crap. Look. There's no way she had an affair. Mm, I, I, I wouldn't be too sure. Anna, uh. <laughs> Busted. <laughs> You're home. Friended. Oh. What's an um friend? But were you in Paris with a lady? I thought this was a work trip. It was. It really was. Tagged along to Denver and Lauren tagged along to Miami and 
Sydney tagged along to Sydney. <laughs> now, now that was a strange coincidence. <laughs> oh, so is he a bit of a, a ladies' man? Now, there are other words, but let's just say ladies' man. Into a hotel suite in a city of romance. Uh, it's actually called the City of Lights. I love Paris. Stop. I've never been, but I, I love I love pictures of Paris. <laughs> I'm going next year. I, I can't wait. Prince and he wants to see mom. It's not good. The only conference he's trying to attend is in mom's pants. I think we should go meet up with him in her place. But before you say no, let's do it. Yeah, let's really? do it. Come on. Really. I like this. I like this. That that's what I would do. I'd cause trouble. I do anyway. This is weird. She's like twice my age, so not as tight. She must be great in the sack. Like, why would you say that? What? An older woman knows how to do things a young woman doesn't, you know. In the banyo. I think you mean in the boudoir. Banyo means bathroom. Mm -mm. Kinky. Oh, yeah. Shut up. Lady. Talking about like I want you to meet dad. Veronica. Hi. Charming and age appropriate. I thought you'd be glad she's not some twenty something floozy who thinks she's she was age appropriate. She looked a lot younger than him. That that I could be very wrong. And I could be I shouldn't assume someone's age, but she did look like she was a lot younger than him. I was really addicted to Pills? Um, no. I was going to say I was addicted to my work. I have a tendency to place my career first. Got it. Mia. Do you have any children? It's a good time to nope. shut up. Well, I'm Mia, I just want you to know I'm not trying to replace your mother. I wish you would replace my mother because then you wouldn't even be here. Hey! Oh! What the hell has gotten into you? I get why she's upset, but this is rude. Come on, Vicky. No. We're not calling them that. I'm under control. Salazar, take a seat and cool down. You're benching me? This is bullshit! I'm not the one having an affair behind Dad's back. Oh. You cheated on Dad with his boss. Okay, we're doing this now in the car. Park. Does he know? Vector. I know. Coffee and just... For sex. I was just... I hope it's not just going to be, we only had coffee together and, and we're friends. Two friends having coffee, listening to music. Oh, and then it... It was Somewhere along oh, the way. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Uh, that as soon as it crossed the line and it got physical, I shut it down. Yeah, we don't need mothers telling their kids about rum people. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. I'm so, I am so, so oh, sorry. This is ridiculous. We are not sympathizing with this lady. I'm not doing this. Oh, poor woman had an affair and she'd just been called out for it. Let's all get emotional because she feels bad. No. She was alone all day, trapped in this huge house in this life that she never wanted. Trapped with me. So, oh, she God. left. No explanation, no goodbye. That's terrible, shitty pair. So why do you tell people that you- I just, I hope it hasn't changed us. I wouldn't. To be honest, if like my mum had an affair, I wouldn't want to talk about it with her. Well, yeah, we didn't have a great week, Simon. Okay. That was a really good episode, but things are starting to get messy. I really, I said at the beginning, I really hoped that we'd get some more character development in these two episodes, and we got a lot more than I asked for, which is great. But things are getting dramatic. I wasn't expecting that stuff about the affair. Um, and I mean, like with Mia and her dad and that girl, that woman situation is all very messy. Yeah, we'll do episode five and six soon.
fact, I might even film them today. I am feeling another two episodes. Yeah. Okay, if you did enjoy this video, then like it, subscribe, and you can follow me on Instagram as well at cards.gaming. And that's it. I'll see you all for episodes five and six very soon. Bye.